Dudes, this is, this is weird. This is very precarious. What is happening, humans? I'm, I'm just trying different shit because I'm in the store. People are walking in. You know, um, I'm scatterbrained 10 times more than usual. I've kind of split these cameras. They're in weird positions. I'm just trying to figure some stuff out. What, what are we trying to do here? Hello, humans. We're gonna take a look at these by Adidas, the Jamal Smith Atomatic. Um, yeah, that's it. The Atomatic Jamal Smith by Adidas. These we've been getting a ton of questions about. In reminiscence of the late 90s, Adidas has released this here, Atomatic. Um, yeah, this is the Jamal Smith Atomatic. Atomatic? I want to say Atomantic, but that's not it. It's Atomatic. So there you go. Here's a good look at this guy right here. This has got your total puffy 90s vibe with your like short toe box that is reminiscent of 90s skate shoes. This shoe fits really good. Um, they didn't make an 11 and a half, which is typically what I wear. I tried on the 11. The 11 fits pretty well, but I think I might get a 12 if the 12 doesn't sell to our customers, I'm gonna scoop this 12 for myself. Um, this shoe, just looking at it, it's like your puffy, super, super 90s puffy vibe with your fat tongue that everybody likes. It's not a super fat tongue, but it fits the shoe perfectly. Um, and it feels, it feels better than a lot of the shoes that are trying to be like, yeah, dude, 90s throwback, and it's just got a puffy tongue on it, and it looks like there's a growth on top of your foot. This feels right. This feels like the way a shoe in the 90s is supposed to look and feel. So the tread looks good with that gum. Um, this is kind of loosely a, um, I don't know, I was gonna say this is kind of loosely a palace collab being with Jamal Smith, but this reminds me of real skateboards. Like if you guys know the Mickey Reyes uh, blazers that came out and all that sort of stuff, like it reminds me of more of real skateboards than of palace, but check out these details on the toe. Pretty sick. The sole looks really thick, but it isn't as thick as it looks. Um, they're super comfy. That's all I have to say about it. I really have no idea how this shoe is going to skate, but true to size, I would say, you know, I'm going to get a 12. I'm usually an 11 and a half. The 11 didn't feel too bad because they didn't make 11 and a half in this shoe. So I'm getting a 12. You could probably go either way if you're normally an 11 and a half. Um, but that's a good look at your automatic. Just like most Adidas insoles, this is thinner than what you would see out of like a Vans or something like the pop cush and all that, which has its place. Like all your padding is in your midsole versus having like a big thick drop in insole. If you're, if you're feeling that nineties vibe, this fits the way a nineties shoe is supposed to fit. It doesn't feel like a modern shoe. Somehow I feel like the modern shoes, they're like, built on the narrowest last you can possibly imagine, squeezing your foot, but then it's puffy. I'm like, how is that even possible? This fits so good. So I hope you guys are digging this. You got your fat laces in here. I'm gonna pull the other shoe out and see what other lace, maybe there's another lace option. No other lace option, so this is it. This is what you get, black fat laces, which is the perfect lace for these shoes anyway. This shoe's a little different. I'm not expecting everyone to love it. It's got a good little flex to it. That's it for the Jamal Smith Atomatic. Let me know what you guys think. I know this look is a little bit crazier than normal. I'm just set up in the shop trying to talk my brains out until someone walks in and interrupts me. So every time I start to try to research or look into some information about these shoes, um, somebody walks in, so, um, or the phone rings. It's frustrating. But I will say this releases on the 14th at midnight. So technically the 15th. Yo, what's up? 
You can come on in. As I was saying... I really kind of hate this setup, but the Atomatic releases um, 514, I believe 515 in shops, but just pay attention between 514 and 515 at midnight, releasing on BlueTileSC.com. So they're coming really soon. Just pay attention to our social media, BlueTileSC on Instagram, and uh, you will know when these Atomatic are dropping. So. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I might just, uh, yeah, that's it. I'm going to wrap this up. Thank you guys for watching. All the best. Love blue tile. And I'm sorry about all the, dude, it is chaotic in here. So there you go. That's it.